We're continuing our tour here at the Shore North, and we are now at On Paper, one of the favorite shops here in the Shore North. I think this is one of the exciting success stories in the Shore North because you've been here since 1997, so 16 years. 16 years, congratulations. The store overall is very much organized by category. So part of our visual merchandising too is very vignette-y and very proppy. So um, I like to try to keep the merchandise categories a little bit cleaner. Uh, one of the things that I also love about your shop, and I think some uh, shop owners sort of lose that, and you've been very consistent with the fixture that you choose. I really don't believe in you just because a vendor offers a fixture and it's free. That's I mean, music it doesn't mean you have ears. to use it. <laughs> it's music to my ears. I think that is one of the biggest challenges. Yeah. You know, no vendor fixtures. Yeah. I, I, I think there are ways to incorporate vendor fixture, maybe you know, re-signing it, mm -hmm. but branding it, manipulating it, it to your match it. Exactly. Yeah. One of my favorite things about On Paper, and I know it adds to the whole experience of the neighborhood, and I think it's a great part of your success, is your windows are always charming. They are always, I think, exciting, and they draw people in. It is probably the singular most important thing about the store, or any store, where somebody has under five seconds to make a determination if you're going to go into a store and cross the threshold or not. Five seconds. Yeah. Um, you know, obviously looking at the dollars and cents of it gives you a sense of satisfaction and success. Good, I was hoping she'd say that. <laughs> because visual merchandising is about driving your sales. Absolutely, absolutely. And we see that time and time again. I mean, it's very clear that you know, we have a dynamic presentation on something, it, it correlates into dollars and cents. Yeah. Um,